Okay, here we have an older Vespoli 4 from Temple Men. And uh, Mike Quinn, an old friend of mine, I could tell you stories about him. He's a great guy, I knew his family. So, this is pretty superficial damage here, although it looks pretty bad. And the boat came with no seats, no foot stretchers, no inspection covers. This is normally what these look like as they get older. The uh, finish is what I'm pointing out. So, uh, doesn't seem to be any mud in there, which is totally cool compared to the other four, which has a ton of mud in it. So the edges here took a beating. Guess that could have been from floating around the boathouse. Now onto the hull and the cut water there is kind of chopped up. But something tells me that's normal wear and tear. Pretty big paint chip there. And I may have spoken in haste about the mud in the stern because when we turned it over, we could hear a bunch of stuff floating around in there. And some of the rigger bolts are missing. Or were taken off, I'm not sure. Another scratch there. And I'm pretty sure that's probably flood related there. And there's a pretty big chunk missing there. And then, as you, you can see on the top, that was pretty gnarly and that's not all that bad. So just got a bunch of paint chips on this guy. Not sure if that was from the rack or not. Maybe not. Rack meaning of hitting the rack. So that's that.